Hello and welcome to Indus News coming to you from the Lahore studios. I'm Aiza Umma and these are the headlines. We start from Libya where the UN security will hold an emergency meeting today on the growing escalation between rival forces in the east and west of the country. Fighting between rival forces is underway after Commander of the Eastern Forces, General Khalifa Haftar, directed his troops to advance and capture the capital Tripoli. Tripoli is governed by the internationally recognized government of Prime Minister Fayez al-Siraj. Next, Israeli forces have arrested 13 Palestinians during overnight raids across the occupied West Bank. Israeli forces also detained an employee of Al-Aqsa Mosque soon after he opened doors to the sacred mosque Bab al-Rehma for worshippers. Moving on, at least 20 Afghan soldiers have been killed in fierce fighting for the control of a strategic district in northwest of the country. Afghan government forces backed by US-led warplanes are fighting to prevent Taliban insurgents from seizing Bala Murghab district in Baghdad's province. Moving on, 22 civilians have been killed in a missile attack by government forces in northwest Idlib province. War monitors said that another 27 people were wounded when the Syrian army fired on a market in the demilitarized zone of Kafir Nabi. They said that women and children were among the victims. The Milwaukee Bucks have been defeated by Philadelphia by 76ers in the NBA to sustain its top position in the race for the titles. Bucks defeated 76ers by 128 points to 122.